and welcome back to another video on the channel, another EAFC 24 video. And today it is Syria team of the season has finally arrived, the final team of the season, and then I believe it is a ultimate tots. However, this is the one that has the worst players and is the least hyped team in the season. I can quickly have a look, but I think there's only like five players that are over a million coins. There is one, two, three, four, five, six players over a mil. And then you've got Ossiemen at 900k, closely followed. Giroud's scraping a million. Bastoni is just about a million. And then the big ones are Leal, Dybala, Martinez and Teo Hernandez. But we did get some nice SBCs and you are going to watch us open packs, complete SBCs and get Team of the Season Syria underway. And now we start off with our 86 doubles. This is the last day of them. Hopefully we get a better pack because, let's be honest, the 86 doubles are not it. We do not pack anything from them. It's just guaranteed exchanges, basically. But... You know what I mean? Mostly, it's just 286s. It's all you ever get. Probably 286s in this one. Oh. Still, though, it's always an 86 and then maybe an 87. And then the occasionally an 88. It's always pretty bad, these. And then the last one is going to be no tots, of course. I mean, Ruben Diaz is good. And then the first man to come into the team today. What a game he had. I watched that game. Wow. Everyone counted Atalanta out, to say the least. And, yeah, this guy. Made in Crawley, apparently. But, yeah, what a player he was in that game. I've always thought Lutman was a decent player. I don't know why people hated on him. And then we open up an exchange pack, and we actually pack Rabio. Which I I was quite happy with. I was like, oh, what a sick. Looked at his price, 30k. Sweet. Not quite sure why. I think he looks quite sick. I thought he would have like 90 plus on all of his stats and be quite sick. But he ain't done him dirty this year. So that is, yeah, definitely, definitely not the one. And then we're going to move into a set of player picks. We did so many player picks. You knew... You, and you saw that I had like 40 exchange packs with the fodder we packed from the 86 doubles. We would send all the fodder 88s and 89s into the exchange. And then the 87s and 6s. And then the 92s and above would go into SBCs. That's how we completed Lookman. And that's how we're going to complete... Renato Sanchez, and we're going to do Trinity Rodman as well, because I had a gold card at the start of the year. Her, Morgan, and Swanson. Rodman and Swanson was like bread and butter. It was like toast and a toaster, or bread and a toaster, should I say. Genuinely, like butter and jam, like literally the perfect pairing. Those two with Morgan, Sophia Smith, the Beanie, those lot at the start of the game were different gravy, and... We gotta pay respects to the old times and get her into the squad. Definitely. We've got to. It has to be done. And in this player pick run here, we have nothing. But our club is super stacked at the minute. We've got like every 82, 83, 84 in the game. It's actually bonkers. Like we're fully, fully stacked at the minute. And I'm glad because we need it. We got Van Dyke in one of the player picks, actually. It's quite a rare one. But we need the stacked club and we're definitely going to keep going. We ain't stopping with uh, our exchange grind. Because you can still exchange grind, put 88s and 89s into the exchange and you can still get back good quality fodder from like dupe tots and high rated tots. Like I've packed Sommer, you won't see that. I packed 94 Germa, you won't see that either. Again, it's just literally not something that I was like... Right, you lot don't need to see me open hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of player picks where I get one tots in like 50 picks. You know what I mean? I get like one tots in 50 picks and then that's all you guys are going to see. Like, nah, it's just not worth it. We will obviously just like show you the key bits. Like, we're showing you the daily play here. 
with some of the draft rewards. I've done all of the draft rewards up to the online games. I just did some offline draft, beginner, put the pad down. You know what I mean? Score one or two goals, put the pad down. And, you know what I mean? That is it. But, yeah, I'll probably, I'm probably not going to do the online ones. I'm not bothered. It's not like an OP, OP reward. It is just quite average and you can get that in many other ways than sweating for hours and hours trying to get eight wins in the um online draft where people are just absolute nutters in there but obviously we i mean just save ourselves the stress we don't need it and, you know, Cuthbert and Bright in that pack. we got to stop and put Bright into the exchange. As we have done. We were going to do a Team of the Week pick, but I couldn't be bothered. We've got an 83 triple. It's going to leave us nothing there. Kimmich and two 83s. That is pretty terrible. 83-10 now. America... That is pretty naff. It's only Horan. 86. Couldn't have been anyone good. We want American Tots though. I want that Sophia Smith or Alex Morgan. And then two 84 plus packs minimum. 844 is going to be England. That is um, terrible. Bronze. Silver. Ramiro. And then the 8410 as the last pack for this bunch is going to be... Odegaard, no, nope. it's going to be Hegerberg and a double. It's going to spin around to someone. Hang on, this might be where I pack. Um, Yeah, it is. Well, there you go. You see me pack Sommer. I got Sommer out of my 8410 with Hegerberg and Pop. Oh, great fodder. Love it. And now we got the 8320 and the 854 from finishing the rest of the cup rewards. We get Di Lorenzo and a double. Two tops in an 8320. It's going to spin around to... Oh my Jesus Christ. They've invited the ginger git. Bernardo, Gundo, Dembele and Cancelo in there as well. And then that pack is going to leave us with nothing. Of course. I think it's Kimmich, I'm going to guess. Yeah, I only saw um, Bayern. So that's how you know it's only going to be Joshua Kimmich or a few other of players. It's not many good buying walkouts. And then we have Renato Sanchez claimed. Great play styles on him. And a great player. He's got that aura from previous FIFAs. And he's an absolute baller. I remember the days at Swansea when he was absolutely terrible. And he turned his career around. What a player. And he's going to go into the team in centre mid. Now lads, before we end the video, you saw us claim two SBCs. One of them is Renato Sanchez and the next one is um oh can't remember his name that's bad uh Adam Ola Lookman that's the one now to get Sanchez on chem we're str I'm struggling a bit I think once Bisex finished he should be should everything should be on full chemistry I'm not too sure because he's a plus card and obviously this Evo now he's an Evo card, so it's taken away the plus. So I think once he's done, he should be in the team with Renato Sanchez. Um, we've also got Sommer on the bench. He absolutely muds the chemistry, though. But I could put in Cafu here, and then the whole team is on full chem. So let me know what you want me to, what I can do, if you have any recommendations. I don't really want the team team to change much. The players that I don't mind taking out are Fakir and Raul. So if there's anything you can suggest out of the players that I have here, um, it would be very much appreciated. I have these guys here, but I kind of just... I don't know what I, f what I think leaving Aspi out for Cafu. Just feels like a step backwards, but... I mean, there's not too much of a difference between them. So maybe I will do that and just put him on for Vasquez or something. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video. Like I said, please try help me get the team on full chem if you can. 
I'll see you guys tomorrow for... It won't actually be Champs because I think I'm a bit busy. I think Champs will be played on Sunday night and it will get it in Monday's video. So stick around for that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching, boys. Have a good day.